is <clears throat> today's topic is uh, non alcoholic uh, fatty liver and a non alcoholic fatty liver, fatty liver disease uh, uh, is the accumulation of uh, abnormal amounts of fat uh, within the liver and uh, uh, it can be divided into isolated fatty liver in which uh, uh, there is only accumulation of fat and uh, non-alcoholic uh, uh, stato, uh, like uh, stato hepatitis, you know, in which uh, there is a fat inflammation and the damage to the liver, you know. And uh, a non-alcoholic uh, uh, Citratop uh, hepatitis are also known as NASH, you know. Uh, it progresses into the scarring and uh, ultimately to the cirrhosis of the liver uh, with all the complications of uh, cirrhosis, like for example, gastrointestinal bleeding, liver failure, and uh, liver cancer, you know. And the uh, development of the non alcoholic fatty liver disease is. Uh, uh, intimately associated with the uh, probably caused by obesity or di diabetes, you know. Now, uh, it is considered a manifestation of the metabolic syndrome, you know, and uh, the symptoms uh, include like. Uh, In fact, uh, the symptoms are the primary those of uh, the complications of the cirrhosis in the patients with the NASH, you know, and isolated fat liver infrequent, uh, frequently causes uh, the symptoms like uh, gastrointestinal bleeding or mental changes, you know, encephalopathy or accumulation of fluid, lysocytes and edema, you know, and liver cancer. And the differentiation of the isolated fat liver disease from the NASH usually requires a liver biopsy and uh, the most promising treatments mm, are uh, diet control you know and exercise weight loss and uh, uh, bariatric surgery you know and uh, several drugs have been studied in the treatment of NASH and there is a little evidence that any drug is effective in slowing the decrease and uh, this progression of the disease you know And the uh, isolated fatty liver rarely progress to uh, NASH, you know, or the cirrhosis. And uh, non-alcoholic uh, fatty liver disease, including NASH, affects the young children as well. So it's not limited to the older only. Um, there's possibility that uh, the young children can also get that. Thank you very much for that. Uh, and uh, you know, one more thing, the NASH will become the number one reason for the liver transplantation unless effective and the safe treatments are found in you. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you need more information about any disease and any medical condition, you can visit our website www.diseasesintreatment.com. And please do not forget to subscribe to this channel for more informative videos every day. Thank you and goodbye.